Hi guys, welcome to this system. It's Arch, right? I keep telling you guys, don't think in boxes. It's all Arch Linux. And this particular thing, if you remember the code, capital F, has been installed with this kernel on January the 2nd of 2020. So this SSD is around for two years, right? 2021, 22, mm, right? 23, maybe, uh, three years, maybe. So the thing is, I would like to build a Carly ISO on Arch Linux. Can I build an Arch Linux ISO on Arch Linux? Can I build LCI on Arch Linux? I have to choose, there are too many projects, right? It's all on the Arch Linux uh, websites and the project is, is wait, is this? A lot is not more, it's just um, more than just Arclinks, it's LCI, it's Carly. And voila, let's try and see if still we can build ourselves a Carly. So, probably gonna find something like this Carly, Arclinx Carly. Let's see what it says. We find Arclinx ISO, home of the Carly project, and then all the other guys got their own websites, right? Because they are really independent of uh, this particular website. So Carly has a lot of knowledge embedded, years of videos, how to move from one place to another place. So it's more a what if workflow, best tips, that's all in there. And in the end, uh, only the largest numbered Carly can be used for building. All the other Carly should only be watched for learning purposes and never built. Okay, cool. So this is the one. That is the one. That's the last things we've done. These are the things we've done to the Carly 11. But if we don't want to download it, right, it's going to be here. Download and have a look. It's basically, well, it used to be a plasma. It's easy. Two, three lines, whoop, switch, and you've got an XFCE desktop. So it's super simple to change desktops in Arch. Thing is, the latest, the Carly GitHubs is what I would like to do. I would like to build it, right? Rather than download it. So this is what we've done like 15 days ago, I see. There are two ways. Either you download the zip and then you delete the zip or you git clone this thing and revisit later. So if you go to desktop number two, super shift enter, we get all this. And then we say git clone, fail to open terminal emulator, couldn't fall back to emulator application, sudo, oh yeah, Alacrity is there. I thought he would miss his Alacrity, but let's have a look. Uh -huh. So it does not contain our stuff, right? It does not contain our, um, well, custom, XFCE custom action thingy. A la gritty. And then forget about all that. Maybe without the F is as, uh, as good as well. well. Let's have a look. So you go out of the way, open terminal here. Okay, without the F. So configure, open, just open a gritty. We'll see. I think it's a little bit different on Arclinux because now we're on might be that it's not opening inside the folder. Yeah, it's okay. Look, here are the root and here we have the folder music. So that's good the way it is. Again, so this is Arch, right? This is not Arclinux. Control Shift V, that's the URL. Cool. Home. I press the button. Home. Where is it? Home. And I forgot to git clone before it, right? Git clone that thing. Boom. That's there. Carly 11. Read what it all says, because at some point in time, you want to be thorough and add a key. Now, keys are an issue. You already know that if you're on Arch Linux, the thing to remember is always sudo pacman minus s Arch Linux keyring. Start with that if you haven't been updating for a while, right? Now we're at the September version. Now it says something about keys here as well. Import Carly key mirror SSH. 
So reads everything that's uh, possible. Let's see at the image. Yep. There is the Ubuntu server. That's pretty good. If you want to get the key. So let's have a look if that's working. And for the rest, this is an code to receive keys. So what I would do as a user is just say, okay, seems I need a key. So I'm going to import key and see if it works. We no longer use this file. It's part of script 1340. Code stays for educational purposes. Okay, got it. So it's going to be here then. Okay, number 40 then. That's not the numlock. The numlock, right. Voila, let's have a look. In the meantime, the Kali key should be in here somewhere. Here is the Kali key ring, right? So we download the package, install the package, saving the package, the key ring, and running the package. So basically the key is trusted and then everything goes as normal like the Arcmelix ISOs. But there will be, or there might be things happening to it, right? Always. So signature from Carly. Article next ISO is invalid, cache sublime text. Okay. You would think I should do something. Yeah, all you need to do is run it again. Why? Well, you deleted the package that was not okay. The sublime text is now okay. Where did I delete it? Pacman did it for you. Somewhere up here. Do you want to delete it? Yes, no. Yes, capital yes. So it's gone. And that's because of the signing. We both have the package. Uh, the Carly ISOs, the Arc Links, um, the Carly repos, the Arc Links repos, um, the package that may be installed from AWAR, right? Signing, it's gone. And when it's gone, it's being re-downloaded. And now we're already installing at line, almost at the end. All the packages are being installed. And a lot of folders. <laughs> I've been building a lot here, but the Carly build is here. There it is. And this is your future system, right? Now they're still finishing up. Voila. He's finished, so that's not. Um, it's always a good thing to do a checkup. Still, everything's still working, right? Ooh. What kind of thing is this? What is this? Help KDE Ocular. Okay, no, thank you very much. Nothing else to have a look at the Bash RC with Sublime Text. Open with another application, always with Sublime Text. Thank you. And this is our Bash RC. It is. So I was thinking maybe I should have a look at the Ctrl-Alt-E, the Arch Linux tweak tool, and get the, the bash, uh, the aliases in, right? The bash RC, but it's already there. So cool. Change the grub as well. In the meantime, it's this funny little Pac-Man thing. So the grub is now this little Pac-Man thing at the moment. But you go ahead and change anything else you like, because that's the fun. It's an Arch Linux application. So whatever you're on, Endeavor West Garuda, doesn't matter. Archcraft, it's Arch. And you decide whether you want to have bits and pieces of it. Do I have VirtualBox on this machine? Uh, it seems to be the case. So we can try out Kali 9, look at that. That's rubbish, that's too old. That's 2021, 2020, old systems. Well, actually all of them can go. And let's use our time to set virtual box right. Super F7. Yep, I just deleted these guys. May May better actually to do it here, remove it here, but okay.
Au revoir. Let's have a look. So the templates, settings. What did I do back in the days? Uh-huh. Cancel. Template. I pressed the right button, did I? Okay, I did not. So, Microsoft Windows, what is this strange thing? Uh, Linux Arch, Linux 64, right, advanced. Normally I do by right, directional, by directional, description, disk encryption, nope. Size 16, that's a bit much. 50-50 is always a good idea. UFI because of the fact that we need to check the grub that it's working. This is okay, acceleration, display. Let's put it all up. Vbox SVG is good. Storage and all that. Audio, often I disable the audio because I'm not testing anything. I'm not playing any music inside the virtual box, but it's up to you. And then maybe a shared folder. That looks like a better template. In the meantime, no, nothing yet as output. We have to wait for the ISO to come out. Let's pause the video. Cool, we've got something, right? 1.3 gigs, which is nothing. Carly, okay. Now, let's have a look. So if I make a clone from for this new build, Carly 11, I put inside this one, yeah. Choose a disk file, yes. Then Carly out, Carly of today, a little bit bigger, so you see, 11, 10, okay, and then we start it. We do a Control F, ooh, that's, that's something, a setting we need to fix, and that's a problem actually. Let's close this and see if we can stop everything. That's always been a pain in the you know where. Machine, uh, stop, stop, shut down. Eh? Ow, 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 close. I need to be able to stop this virtual machine. Ah, this is a misery. That is always a misery. If I've, ah, I have done an alt shift, an alt, an alt, yeah, alt, alt, alt tap, I think, yeah, control shift escape. Let's see if I can get something no control t peak hill virtual box two a lot of possibilities to kill <laughs> how is this thing called Virtual box, capital letter. Virtual box. And there's another one. Let's see if it's still there. Yes. No, at the end here, it's not there anymore. So, do I still have it? No. Okay, super. Super F7. I found myself a way to get out of it. So, Carly 11. Uh, what I forgot, what I forgot was, uh, where is that again? Where is it again? User interface, show on full screen seamlessly. That's the wrong thing. Yeah, I think so. Start and then control F. And now we see something. So Carly Linux install medium. So this is the Arch Linux way of booting up, right? So these two lines, that's it. And then we go and install Carly. In Carly, we keep very, very close to the Arch ISO Relang. Uh, just search for the word Relang Arch ISO, Arch Wiki, for example. You'll find some one one page actually, but it's a start. And then you keep looking for the word on Arclex. Okay, looking good. Next, 
Belgian next race fine no swap all good and we start installing everything next install install voila so then it's time to look around so this is the Calamars installer free of charge um, I mean it's it's a great team making it possible that we can install Linux on our SSD hard disk NVMe and then uh, have a free operating system so it's a delivery system Calamars and for the rest I just did a choice choose display manager SDM, LightDM choose the desktop XFC, Mate, Plasma it used to be Plasma I think in Carly 10 so it's just a switcheroo it's, it's super super simple really is and for the rest yeah it's a wallpaper I guess as well and some icons and uh, let's have a look at the settings but I kept it very simple and the mouse cursor I think as well so are darker icons papyrus dark and yeah the in XFCE doesn't make sense for us maybe but here it is mouse that's where the theme is so the captain captain cursors right I like the white one so it's a very small little thing just to have something different than the Bibata cursor that we use on our clinics. And it's all about configurations. And if you're a developer, if you want to be a developer of this shows, this is where you need to be. This is where your configuration is, your badge RC is here, which is still the default from Arch Linux. Here's your configuration of XFC. How does your XFC look? Uh, defined here how does your tuner look well if you have the folder tuner then you can add some stuff in there how's the desktop ah the desktop needs this one for the guy to boot up well to provide a click a clickable eh, icon to install calamars and all the rest is still very much arch so this is where you put more stuff in here if you put more stuff in each syscal the user will get more stuff and now we have a look see that everything works so it's a full it's a full circle test can we build Carly on Arch Linux can we then install it and is everything okay control T uh, did I do control T yeah okay <laughs> it's it depends right you can set your own key bindings no problem NeoFetch. We're on Arch Linux. We're not, yeah, we're on Carly, but we're on Arch Linux. And a few things, let's have a look. Pseudo Pacman minus R, Carly. That's it. We have a grub, looks nice. A keyring to sign the packages, the middle list, where are the packages, and an XFC config. This is minimal, super minimal. Now let's have a look at the update. Can we update? No, pseudo pacman minus s y y u. Yes, we can update. Glibc is in there. Glibc is now fixed. Yeah, true. So I'm gonna get rid of the old Glibc that's on our repo from Carly. This is no longer an issue. It was an issue. It's no longer an issue. So we can put it on the ISO as well. That's it quick look at the check that I've made now on on uh, Arch Linux system D system system and these things we don't want on Arch Linux but they're here because we follow Relang and I don't see Pac-Man and that's what I'm gonna that's why I'm here to have a look if everything is working just fine and yes so you can see we can update our system and that's the thing right pseudo pacman well we've seen it already but voila why why you there is no AOR is there Paru yay yay is installed so this we can get get an update for yay if we want to but well it's up to you to decide all that voila finished uh, video is finished check 
what I'll do is uh, pop in the SSD. You have the, I have this bay on all my machines. Pop in the SSD of um, Carly and get rid of the glibc there, and then that will be that. And you'll have the possibility to build Carly 11 yourself on Arch Linux, on DevOS, on Garuda, on anything Arch except uh, Manjaro, right? Enjoy.